Hello? Hi. Okay. Okay, welcome viewers uh, to our fifth game of the season. I am Vainsu, and I'll be here with my co-caster, Sky Attic. That's me. Okay. Let's make sure everything is, like, good to go. Uh, so how did you think about the draft? From both sides. I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm liking the picks on MSU's side. It's You're looking like... extremely aggressive. Yep, I, it is looking aggressive. Um, UMKC has had a decent season so far. I think they're like even two and two. Um, their picks look to be a little bit early aggression with the Lee Sin and uh. Maybe safe with the bot lane. Yeah. Definitely a safe pick with the bot lane. But uh, Missouri State has a pretty aggressive uh, bot lane with Jin, Pike, so they'll also be looking for picks. Yeah, it wouldn't, wouldn't be hard for them to get an early pick. Yes, yeah, this is definitely an interesting game. But I am can't wait to see what's going to happen. As Missouri State is actually uh, undefeated right now. And looking to take another win. It's definitely looking that way. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Also, Solzin Puyaha is actually on his signature cast in, so we might be seeing some spicy gameplay from the mid laner today. I have some seen some <laughs> extremely top tier gameplay from this Puy <laughs> on Cassidy. Yes, you have. He's very proud. He's very <laughs> proud of his cast today. Oh, man. Yeah. The game's going to be up and coming in probably like a couple minutes, but there's not really much background on UNKC's side, except that I think their their program's been here for a couple years. Uh, I don't know any of the players, but the MSU JV1 team... Uh, was formed like this semester. And they they've had pretty good success. Mm. So spicy they'll, starter reps. They'll be looking to make a good run in playoffs. That'll be fun to see. It will be. Okay. Is your client uh working all right? My client is working fine. All right. Has some interesting technical difficulties. There was some difficulties. Okay. Okay. Mm. The game is loading up. Morgana mid. Yeah, Morgana mid was a uh, definitely a pick. That cleanse. That's yeah. an interesting pick. It's definitely a pick that we didn't see coming. Necessarily, as we uh the the team, I looked like they triple banned out their mid laner, his comfort picks. Yeah, I, it was definitely intriguing to see uh you guys banning out the support whilst seeing a Morgana. Yeah, I think the uh the team did a little bit of research mm. and knew some strats that UMKC was trying to pull off in the draft phase. Strats. Yeah. Mm. The mid laner, I, well, I did some research and I knew that they would play Morgana, so I looked to double ban their support and put them on an uncomfortable champion, but that's a little side note. It's definitely interesting. Not what I was looking at while uh, noticing the bans was just Extremely interested yeah. that you were banning banning supports while saying that we're gonna. That's yeah. uh, that makes sense now. Yeah, it makes For sense, sure. but maybe it's not to the viewers at home. Mm -hmm. Still, the cleanse choice. Yeah, the cleanse choice looks to be made in case of the early aggression from the Camille. In case uh, Camille wants to make some early plays mid lane, but we'll see. We'll see how. Well, junglers play the game out 
as they're both early game junglers. Hmm. Definitely, Yumke sees bot side in mid. Look to play kind of passive. Morgana just wants to AFK farm and look, make picks, it looks like, also. And Ezreal's also a safe laner. Yeah, having two flashes is always nice. It is nice. A little bit of kleptomancy. Yeah, he gets some gold to get to his items. <sighs> we'll see. Oh, the game has started on my end. It's loading up as we load up on the rift. We are looking at the rift. <laughs> Okay, and we still have a KDA intro. Mm -hmm. We got MSU on the on the red side. It's a little bit of communication from lots of, lots of communication going yeah. on. Looks like UMKC is stacking uh, on the red side. Doesn't look like they're gonna go for invade, yeah, but just doesn't look like anyone's going for invade. Just staying safe. UMKC is pointing out that Nar should be at the entrance, but it doesn't look like he's going over there. But <laughs> there's this new things yeah, are actually he's just going. Not interested. <laughs> Question mark things are also okay. The Nar's finally. Minara is finally woken up. <laughs> and he just goes back. <laughs> he puts a ward Very down nice. just in case for the invade. Mm. Mm. All teams are just sticking safe looking for an invade that's not going down. Yeah, it's we usually or call this play. usually call it five point. And everyone just like is that the entrance? Just make them aware that no one does invade. We can have some vision if we need be. Looks like Camille is looking to make a top play. Extremely, extremely early gank. We'll see how this is going to go down. Too? She is. Ooh, the oh, Ooh, they get the, the flash? flash. The Ooh, it looks double like the flash going down. and a first that's, blood. That's from first Camille. blood right there. This is really a good start for Missouri State. That is definitely. Oh, Ooh. it looks like some more stuff. Are, are skirmishing. And the mid lanes are also skirmishing. Ooh. Oh, it looks Looking like. Lead. This looks like Ooh. it might. If he hits his Q. Ooh, oh, ooh, the, the flash. double flash, the Q. Ooh. The smite. The ooh. Oh. Ooh. The least sand. Late makes rotation it by Gansman. Yeah, That's a little a bit play, late. Like, by their mid laner and jungle. Looks like Nara was also rotating down. Hmm. It's a little bit of disrespect by the Camille by fighting him, but yeah, a little bit uh, a little bit early to play that uh, aggressive. Hmm, <laughs> Atrax is shoved under his tower. Usually happens in this matchup. Nara has a favorable early game against Melees. Still even on CS. Doesn't look like anything fun's being done in the bot lane. Yeah, it looks like bot lane is just farming it out. Right now, just making some short trades, just looking to scale up. Looks like Pike is looking for a pick. Ooh. He's got the stun. Got, He's got the a stun, nice. Yeah. This is a nice trade. It, it was, a, it was a, 
It was a decent trade. It was a decent trade. It looks like it went even because it looks like Nami's just going to heal up the part of the damage that was done. Mm. Ezreal's doom. Yeah, it looks like good time for Pike to make a play. He gets the pick. Yeah, he's doing it. Ooh, uh, the Lee Sin's there. Lee Sin hits the Q. Ooh. Lee Sin's making some early aggression plays. The Ignite pops off. The Ignite pops off. And they miss everything. So well. Lee Sin's making some decent plays around the map. He's getting some summoners. So. He's definitely applying his pressure. His, n his name uh, suits him as it's nerfed Lee Sin. So, looks like he's definitely comfortable on this champion. May or may not be a one trick. <laughs> Looks like Camille's making another round top. Ooh. Nice That's play. Second death on our. Even though there's a little bit of early mishappens, the the Camille's making some good plays around the map too. The Camille is still. Still gonna be a factor. Stay strong, yeah. Some plays being made in the bot lane. Yeah, it looks like Ooh, Lee Sin yeah. made being another visit. By the Lee Sin. He's just not letting anything happen. For sure. Looks like Lee Sin is trying to make maybe a play mid, but Cassin's mm -hmm. is looking yeah, to. There's nothing happening there. Yeah. This Morgana is not doing much because Cassin is, is pathing towards the Camille. Oh, but she just finished and is walking away. I don't. I don't know Pings how. Pings being thrown down yeah. on the least end. Is that Pings from blue side or red side? I didn't. I didn't get a chance. That was, to see. I think that was red side. It's good tracking from the red side. It looks like. For sure. Hmm. Ooh. What? Oh no. Okay. I thought the red side was was down at second turret on bot lane, but that's just the bot lane coming back. Yeah, yeah. Nothing much happens. Some early skirmishes so far, but definitely top side is looking to be a good winning condition for Missouri State right now. Uh. Nara's definitely, uh, they're trying to take him out of the game. He's still looking good on CS, though. Looks like, uh, the Gasson is looking for some vision or, or roam. Maybe top. He's looking like for a roam top. This is gonna He's be interesting. He's looking to shut down that Gareth, Gareth, Nara third time. Yeah, this Nara is definitely not gonna have a fun time. In this game no, it right now. Doesn't look like Nara's award. <laughs> yeah, it looks and like gonna... they get the flash. Ooh, the flash. Looks like another play was made bot. Ooh, yeah. The flashes and the ulti. The Camille. This is gonna turn out is... good. Ooh. Ooh. Looks like Camille is about gave some shutdown. Ooh. Maybe is that a shutdown? No, it's uh, not a shutdown, but No, that wasn't a shutdown. Looks like Camille's making a, being a little bit too aggressive and not playing Yeah. The normal game he usually plays. I might end up uh, giving that bot lane a chance. Looks like another player. It's happening top. Just a 1v1. That's a lot of damage Ooh, coming out from the Aatrox. The Aatrox is just, <laughs> just dealing the damage. Respect. Very nice. Oh, it looks like the bot lane. Uh, another gank by Lee Sin. Looks like Lee Sin is making some plays. Hmm, sitting in a really nice tent. That is working out very well for him. Oh, 
Looks like the Snar. <laughs> Looks like the Nar is gonna die again. <laughs> the Nar is not having fun as he is 0 and 4 with 37 farm at nine minutes in. Uh, he's not gonna be worth much gold for much longer. <laughs> this keeps up. Definitely setting the Atrix up for uh, a nice carry. Looks like Missouri State is making a lot of plays top. There was a play mid, but right. things aren't looking to go the way Missouri State was wanting in the bot lane, so. We'll see. They're clearing up some vision down, so. Maybe they won't get ganked without knowing. Hmm. Looks like NAR is now respecting the ganks and, uh,. Putting control word down on the top river. Yeah, double, double control words in the top. Is that river. Okay. Yeah. Oh yep, he, that's uh, that's pixel brush. Yep. <laughs> Looks like he doesn't want to be ganked from river. Cast and picking up some vision. It looks like Missouri State is getting Ooh, another, there. Another good bot lane. An ulti? Oh, oh it is it not. Like I picked. Hmm. Who'd that kill go on to? Was that it went the to the Nami. The kill went to the Nami, which is. Definitely better for their team. It's not. It's, not, it's still not ideal. It's not ideal, but. There's getting some pressure on the balling tower. It looks like a skirmish is coming down in the balling yeah, river. The balling but... turret is uh, it's taking a lot of damage. Yeah, for sure. Looks like they might collapse on the bot lane. Ooh. We'll see what's happening. But this is going to turn oh, it into looks a three v four. Looks like 3v4. it's going to a four v three. Yeah. Mike's coming in. Looks like the blue side's looking to reset. Yeah. Some of them are. Looks like uh, Nari got some more farm since we last looked at it. Yeah, a little bit more. So I don't know how much uh, impact what is he's going to have. To build? Tank. Hmm. Yeah, most Nari's yeah. built like Black Lever first, but. He's, he's picked up a Clomp Armor. Looks like, the ch is this gonna be a cheese? Looks Ooh. like it might work. He's him Looks like he just yep. stood there, but. Hmm. There's some good damage off mid. Oh, this looks, looks to like be in the favor of. Got a lot of health in his nar farm, and then left away. Yeah. Definitely, UMKC is putting some good vision to stop this Camille from. Making some plays around the map, but it also doesn't look like Leeson's interested at all in stopping this Atrax. Yeah, from face rolling down this lane. Oh, extremely interested in completely shutting down this bot lane, though. Yeah, looks like uh, Missouri State is actually going to get the top lane tower and. It'd be really huge of... for Missouri State. Mm, yep, it's definitely, it's Wait. definitely going down. Doesn't look like anyone's in a position. Oh, it looks like, best. looks like mid lane is trying to bait something. Okay, bait AFK. I don't. Yeah, it looks like Lucian's not too interested. Yeah, the I don't top. Think anything's gonna go down. Looks like Lisa <laughs> might be looking boy, to rotate, like but then Nar instantly caught out by the Camille. <laughs> Let's 
They yell, ooh, and yep. he escapes. It looks like Nara's in a sicky situation. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> and the Lee Sin. For the turret dive. <laughs> yeah, this top side of the map play is definitely getting some, be a little bit interesting. It's As... definitely got a lot of traction up top. Shredding another turret top line. No one t anywhere to contest. Yeah. And it's gone down. Yeah, tier 2 tower taken from top. This is really big for Missouri State. Looks like we got a flash from the mid laner. Looks like we're looking for a pick. Ooh. And we got the pike ulti. Ooh, the pike ult. It, it was it literally it was clipped. Oh my. Bale this... looking to slap the Nar again. <laughs> the Nar is not yeah, yeah, having He's gone down. Leeson. Ooh, can she catch the Leeson too? Looks Ooh, like the one v one damage. Ooh, Atrex. Oh, in. the. Ooh. Is he gonna get the auto? Ooh, Ooh that was that so Atrex. close. Lovely play. Looks like UMKC is definitely gonna be tilted at this moment, but oh, hopefully, maybe they can make a comeback. We'll see. Their bot lane is going even, so. Is it still even there? Oh, yep. Yeah. Is it even? The gen on the uh, on MSU is kind of behind. Actually, it looks like Missouri State uh, is behind 1K. Ooh, on it looks like Camille's problem. gonna die to Rift Herald. <laughs> He's making a spicy. Play. Hopefully, he doesn't uh, die to jungle. Yeah, get killed by a jungle man. It'll definitely be a very sad moment for him. But yeah, would it be extremely funny? <laughs> yeah, it would be funny. Looks like he got the rift. Yep. They might look to break open the top if they can get a pick off the Nar. The enemy bot lane looking, looking for something. Mid and then switching immediately to the bot lane that Jin is smashing. <laughs> it, it, this Ooh. Aatrox is unstoppable it looks like. Doing mass amounts of damage. Also looks like Katzen's looking to scale right now. Another skirmish is happening bot lane. We'll see what's happening. Jin's gets a pick with his W. It looks like a double TPs are coming in on the bot side. We'll see what's about to happen. Ooh. Camille, it is turning to be a 5v5 down the bot lane. MSU is looking to win this right now. Camille's 1v3. Oh, this is Ooh. huge. Camille is just doing tons of damage. Yep. It looks like the Nami is stuck in a pickle right now. It looks like she's it not gonna like have. They're, <laughs> looks like they're looking to sandwich her in. But then <laughs> no escape. But the Nami picks up one. Mm. Oh, did the oh the Nami picked up Camille? Yeah, Camille probably should not have uh, went in. Yeah, that was honestly uh, way better than they, they uh, deserve to get from that. Low Nami. Dang. Looks like Missouri Missouri State's just taking over this game right now. It, I don't know what UMKC can do at this moment. Yeah, there's no pressure on the map. They don't have many big players. gaston has been playing the game, just trying to farm it out. Yeah, it looks like looks he's like... looks like he's just trying to scale for a late game that might not even happen. Yeah, letting other players play play big big fiddle. <laughs> just mining for gold. Just uh, everyone's putting down some vision, clearing some vision right now. Nothing huge is going on. Looks like uh, Aatrox might 
make a spicy play top. We'll, we'll see. Nah, it just looks like he's just gonna get the farm, but... Cast it looks in. Like they're, looks like they're looking to apply a lot of pressure mid. Rift Arrow's gone down. Oh, yeah. It's Rift. Let's smack that turret. It looks like it's only... Oh, this looks like a big play, yeah. Dev. No one able to contest. Oh, uh, it They're looks like done. Aatrox is just like killing everybody. Aatrox going around. Aatrox and Camille. Looks like Nar might be going down for the eighth time this game. This Nar is not having fun. Ooh. As six on blue side, twenty on red side. The rift is about it looks to open like that up the base. Is definitely gone. Yeah, 20 seconds on the entire enemy team. Is this Rifty gonna hit another like turret? The... Looks like Rifty's gonna hit another turret. Ooh. Did they yep. hit another one? Yep. Man. Their base is falling to shambles. Yeah, 20 minutes it's in. It's all in pieces. 20 minutes in. I'm not sure what blue side's win condition is. I think it's maybe gonna if red side, red side would have to make a lot of mistakes, and like one v five, everybody keep one v fiving. Looks like the bot lane just gonna pick one up at a time. Yeah, just one Into at a time. Into the jungle. Bot lanes getting the dragon. An interesting Ezreal ult. Yeah. I think, yeah, it looked like he was trying to push the wave off the turret bottom. Yeah, this... Snar did not have a fun game this one, it looked like. I don't think the Snar got to play the game. <laughs> the result does apply a lot of pressure late game. If he can get there... <laughs> Nothing much. It looks like uh, Aatrox is going to split down bot lane. Maybe they might contest Baron. Um, looks like the Lee Sin is getting picked out. Yep, looks like Lee, Lee Sin, Sin is just going... And jumped right out. Lee Sin and Camille. Kasten. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's my bad. I was saying Kasten when I meant... At least... Well, I said Lee Sin when I meant uh, Kasten. But mm. yeah, Kassin's makes some early aggression well, not some plays. damage. Looks like they're going to make Baron play right now. Uh, they're with their jungler down. Not much they can do to stop them. They look like they're Kassin's just playing a ward. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they're sending two for this Aatrox down bot also. I think they would have to send that, at least four. I don't think four. that's enough. Yeah, I don't think... It looks like this Gasson is about like to three. They're chasing the a double kill ooh, from the Aatrox. Ooh, yep, there's the double kill. It looks like they might pick up the Aatrox. Oh, oh yep, this... Nar's coming in. Is Nar coming in to get revenge? Ooh, stopwatch. Uh, ooh, yeah, ooh, Nar revenge. The Nar has there picked up a kill. <laughs> Big shutdown gold. Mm. But it looks like Missouri Bot State's looking to reset whilst uh, Missouri State's taking top, top turret. Line. Yep. Nars uh, jumping along slowly in his big nerf. Oh, the Nar trying to make some big plays. They might be but... able to make a pick. Ooh, yep. We'll see if they get the the Pike. The Pike's pretty pike. slippery champion, but. Looks like uh, UMKC is not going to get anything done. Yep. With that chase. Looks like they're just going to walk away. Looks like Kasten's making his way down by and going to look for the bot in Hip Tower. Mm. Looks like Kasten. Can he dive this Ezreal? It looks like this. Ooh. Oh, this Kasten, he's gotten out. Oh, Camille's coming in. Looks like Pike is joining the fight too. 
Ooh. That's a lot of blue deaths. That's a lot. I think this game is going to be ending really soon, guys. But Definitely a fast game. It's definitely a fast game. There's yeah. a, a red TP. It looks like it's ending right now. Yeah. Oop, like... Nar. Yeah. Doing something. I know. I think Nar. The disrespect killed in the. <laughs> this killed in the turret. Yeah. Well, that yes. ends game one with Missouri State picking up the first win. Still uh, unbeatable. Still unbeatable. Well, <laughs> right now we're going to take a, a short break while the team readjusts and gets back into the lobby. But. Uh, we'll catch you guys later in the next 10 minutes. Hello guys, uh, I'm back, and the game's about to start soon, so, uh, I don't know if my other co-caster's here right now. Your other co-caster is here. Okay, my main co-caster, Sky Attic. Yep. Uh, how do you think of this draft? Uh, it looks like, uh, they decided to pick Nar again. Yeah, it looked like they did pick Nar. Missouri State's draft is pretty troll. Not gonna Missouri lie. Missouri State's completely <laughs> attempted to ban out the mid lane. Yeah. Leaving him with nothing. So Mazahar does look like a better pick than uh, Morgana. Yeah, it does. But I don't know how, uh, how comfortable this man is with uh, Mazahar. Yeah, I don't know either. But we'll see as the game goes on. Seems oh. like Benar's not completely tilted from last game, still. It feels like giving it another shot. Yeah. But we'll see how this game uh, plays out when uh, the game starts rolling. But honestly, I the Missouri State draft is honestly really trolling. And yeah. the, I think it's it's purely solo queue draft. But we'll see. Hopefully they can make early game plays like they did last time and uh, come out with the victory. Hopefully. Looks like UMKC did try to ban out the uh, the jungler after feeling all that pressure. Yeah, it does look like they banned him out. They also look like they, they swapped orders so they could maybe get their, their supports pick. This game. Yeah, definitely, uh up the priority of their sports uh give it a champion. Which honestly might turn out well. Uh, it might despite it, being banned out, uh the bot lane did pretty well last game. Yeah, they did a lot better than Missouri State would expect, but hopefully Missouri State plays the game better than they yeah. did last time in the bot lane, but We'll definitely see what happens um, as the game is about to load in. Last game was pretty, uh, pretty much a stomp, and it's surprisingly that Nar, or the nice. top laner, picked Nar this game. But. Uh, 
definitely an interesting pick. Yes, but Nar only got one kill, so wasn't on the eight track. Yep. Maybe he's got high hopes. Maybe he does, but we'll see. Hmm. Also, did not noted, been out the lease in. Yeah, they didn't. They didn't look to think that the lease in was too much of a problem, but. He seemed like he was applying the most pressure last game. He was. I saw. He was applying much pressure, but he didn't. He it, didn't secure them the win. So maybe Missouri State doesn't think that that he can do it this he time. He can do it this time. Yep. Mm. Pike is running uh, a pretty weird rune. So predator. It looks like Ooh, he might start to run. Predator. But, yeah, it looks like he went that last game too. That's a fun pick. Oh, he did go in the last game? Yeah, he, he went in the last game. I didn't notice it either. Usually pikes go uh, aftershock. That. Yeah, they go aftershock, Good but point. maybe the meta's changed with the lethality changes on him. But we'll see as this game is looking to load in on the rift, but still people are some loading in. Just looks looking like... at the icons, it looks like MSU is more unified. <laughs> <laughs> it does look like they're more unified. All the the same icons, same club tags. UKC is also running the same club tags too, but completely different icons. That's gonna lose them the game. Yeah. <laughs> Italy. Italy is the jungle pick. I haven't seen that in a long time. We haven't seen the Nidalee from Clyde. Aren't you a Nidalee player, Skydick? I was a Nidalee player for several seasons. Yeah. Not in the jungle. Not in the jungle. Especially uh, for a while, her uh, thing didn't snare the... I don't think her thing still snare the monsters. I think they removed that. Her yeah. passive used to snare monsters. Yeah, that was quite a while ago. I think two seasons ago. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, it looks like we're loading in After on the After that, rift. I didn't give it another chance. Yep. Have you loaded in the rift, too? We are seeing the rift. Okay. And the health of the, uh, the ultimate tower. Still taking a few... There we go. Mm -hmm. Now I'm loaded in. The minions cheering on the team. For another uh, another victory. And I see you looking to make it a quick stream. Yep. Two games. 2 0 will be the bet. What Missouri State is looking for. Hopefully, they are not wanting to go into another game. We'll see. It looks like UKC is stacking. I'm putting a word down. Not much. Mm. Look for a second like they were looking for an invade. Looks like Missouri State is having a weird positioning than normal. They usually start five point, but I don't know what they're doing this game. Must not think it's necessary. A lot of communication going on. Yeah, a lot of pings are going down. Maybe the, the NAR might have a chance as uh, the Nelly jungle doesn't have as much CC as... Uh, Isn't going to be able to catch him out that early. Yeah. yeah. He might be able to get some early plays in than he did she last does that heavy early damage. Their full combo. Looks like uh, both junglers started on the the bot side of the map. Looks like they. Safe choice. 
They're also both moving to the top. They might. There might be some early scuttle contention in the next few minutes. For sure. For sure. Slap. Looks like Looks the like NAR is about to first. Ooh. first blood. First blood. On the Irelia. This is something that's not. Looks <laughs> like really not what we expected. <laughs> this is Italy not going. Getting caught out of the jungle. <laughs> this is not what Missouri State wants. Definitely not a good start to the game. I feel like Missouri State. Heading mid. Yeah. Putting it on the way, Pang. Missouri State is disrespecting UMKC a little bit too much. Ooh. Mm. Italy is set up to counter gank, but it looks like she's too weak to pull anything off at the moment. Lisa and getting both scuttles. Looking to push that lead by uh, heading into Nidalee Jungle. Ooh, Looks like... We do. Oh! Ooh. The Nar barely making it out alive. Lee Sin's making plays all around the map. Hmm. Italy. Set up on mid. Oh my, it looks like Ooh, Aurelia is getting pushed into top red jungle. Aurelia. And she's out for the count. <sighs> definitely. Uh, getting his revenge. Definitely getting revenge now. This is not what Missouri State. <laughs> Setting State. up for a NAR carry. Yeah, this is the opposite of what happened last game. <laughs> A TP coming down from Nar. Nar is making the plays this game. He wasn't having it last game, and he's trying to make it up. Man, I don't. Hopefully, the mid lane can be a factor for Missouri State this game. Oh. Well. Ooh. A nice spearhead, but. Missouri State's only getting some pressure. No kills coming down from Missouri State, but. Mm. It looks like. Uh... Actually, they're just, they're just gonna apply their pressure to take some, uh, some spicy damage there. Yeah, some damage coming down the entire. Looking at the bot lane, looks like the Sivir has a uh, quite a big CS lead with a well, 10 CS lead right now at six mm -hmm. minutes. So, but mid laner Ooh, also... get that first back BF. Yeah, it's gonna be really big for the bot lane as the Ezreal only comes back with the tier, so it's definitely not gonna be much of a factor with damage in this early game, but. We'll see for sure, how for sure. we'll see how everything goes. Even though the two deaths from top lane, the top lane's CS is still even, so 
It's not the really is not getting punished as hard, but the kills are definitely gonna be a factor in the next ten minutes and see what's gonna happen. It's definitely playing it extremely far back. Yeah. Now afraid of the nerf. Some early game poke. Uh, some poke going down, but. See if Aureli's gonna win this? She's gonna get before the. Oh! Mm. The mid is, uh. Pushing into the jungle. Trying oh. to catch up the Nidalee. The Nidalee. The top got solo killed again. This is. Not good for Missouri State. Definitely not going to be a stomp like it was last game. Certainly not on MSU side. Yeah. This game is not going the way Missouri State is wanting to. Ooh. And. Fight going down mid lane. Close. Ooh. Is he going to get the kill? The flash. Ooh. Oh! Double the turnaround ooh. from Cassidy. The turnaround and he got the flash. This is really big for this mid lane, as everyone else is not playing up to what they should be playing. Bot lane's going pretty even, but they're out game behind CS. Mm, yeah. Italy getting kicked into mid turret. Yeah. Not much happening. Getting out mostly unscathed. Yeah. Ooh. Like, <laughs> oh, Ooh. and the turnaround with the Q. Oh, that Lee Sin disrespecting there. the Nelly and didn't end too well for him. Well, Pike mm. looking for a play Pike lane. missing a lot uh, of his uh, uh, pulls. Yeah, definitely <sighs> pretty big for her. I don't think playing might be the best opportunity also. Looks like the Gnar. Oh, I missed ult. Grabbed a flash. Oh my the gosh. Ooh, this... It's the Gnar. Smashing Nidalee. This Gnar is general. trying to take over the game. As, man, he is upset about last game's results. <laughs> trying to make a difference. Definitely didn't let it get him down. Yeah, he's definitely turned that game into motivation. I really are looking to get caught up by Nar again. <laughs> yeah. The running away. Lee Sin coming in. Trying to oh do my... exactly what they did to the Nar. A TP from the mid laner. Is the really gonna get unscathed? Is this gonna be a turnaround? The so, oh, flash? The Kassin is gonna get the kill. Is the Kassin about they to are... Ooh, Ooh, yeah, The Kassin yeah, yeah. looks like he's about to. I really oh, got taken is the out by in? the Mazahar. Oh, Ooh. The, the nice dodge. Mazahar still has ultimate, so it's not... One for one, not ideal. Yeah, are they looking, looking for the... Do something. Ooh. Ooh, oh, you got the, the ghost spear. out. Got the ghost. Nark coming up from behind. Looks like a lot of plays are having... And the plays are lasting so long that this Lee Sin is about to join back in. Yeah. <laughs> the Nidalee and the Kasten pushed into their jungle. Caught out. Ooh, Kasten ult. Or not. <laughs> Mazar ult. Yeah. Giving Nar another kill. Yeah, it looks like Missouri State is playing this game really sloppy, but hopefully they can pull out the W, but 
looks like this game might be a little bit longer than last game. And we might go into the third. Ooh. The Braum getting an ulti. Ooh, with the Pike Sun stopping the engage, but is Aureli going for again? It really is going for another 1v1. But now it's not this a 1v1. This one's turning out in their favor. Oh, Ooh. but the snipe Deadly from the Nidalee taking up the kill. Maybe Nidalee can pick that up and apply some pressure across the map. <clears throat> Balin just getting pressured in, man. He's just trying to survive, it looks like. And hopefully it's still up. even. It's a little bit even. Let's see how much... She has about a, lead. a 600 gold lead right now, so it's, it's, it's getting bigger, but maybe the Ezreal might be abused at 20 minutes when he gets his two items. Except for picking up a Storm Razor, it's pretty big. That first item. Looks like Lee Sin's been a little bit quiet on the map, not making that many plays. Nidalee it's taking serious. Rift Herald. Oh, Nidalee going for the early Rift Herald. Lee this... Sin spooked by the Cassadin. Yeah. While she continues to take the Herald. This Herald would be huge if they can pick it up. Ooh. They need... Is she gonna die for the Herald? She's gonna have to flash... Flashing out. Flashing out into the The Pike right Roam coming in. Getting... His casting boy out. Let's. It's nice roam by the pike to sell the situation. And but, man, the spot lane. He's just getting pushed in. Yep. Forcing Ezreal into tower. Missing uh, missing some CS. Yeah, it looks like bottom tier tower might go. Ooh, top tier. Oh, he's looking oh. like he's pathing the bottom. Looks like top. The Aurelia was hiding in the bush the whole time. And they're making Ooh. some plays on top. He got the flash out, but you can't flash Maybe. from Aurelia Q. We're looking yeah. to shut this Nar down. Looks like they might send the Rift top and, and stop the uh, UMKC from getting the first tower. But UMKC is looking to take the first tower. We'll see what's going to happen. They, it looks like UMKC did not get the first tower blood as Xerxes got in clutch the last second. Looks like Xerxes another out. turret. It doesn't look another like anyone's turret. in a position to stop them. Are they going to go for another one? Is Pike going to get the backstop? Uh, they might get a little bit more damage on the top tier tower, but. Missouri State looks like they're turning this around. Looks Ooh. like they're overextending though. Ooh. Looks like they might get picked. And it looks like both both players are gonna get picked off. With this in that, turn, that Ezra turret is destroyed though. <laughs> yeah, Ezreal's also got some tower damage. It looks like the Pike is making a roam bot or mid. My bad, my bad. But Pike's looking like he's about Pike to just ulted. die. Looks like the miss ulti from the Pike. This might be a Ooh. kill for Missouri State. Flash. No, but the Braum comes in clutch with the shield and the W. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks like... looks like... Both the players mid are going to get out, but it looks like that turret's Long gone. not doing too well. Yeah, Missouri State is... They have a slight goal lead, but Both with the teams, towers. Both uh, teams pushing for that dragon. Yeah. Staying on the way. Well, it looks like Aureli is almost caught out. Aureli looking to in. contest. Yeah. Looks like both teams got pushed off the dragon. Looks like that cloud Looks like they might be for pulling for the. Oh no. Pike misses going... another Q. Yeah. 
team does not seem to be going the way Missouri State had it last game. Last game in 20 minutes, man, the game was almost GG, but now it's 20 minutes coming in. Looks like Baron might be a factor for both teams to challenge to get the win. Hmm. The, the, the first tier mid turret is still up. Huh? There goes the Cladric. Yeah, Cladric taken by Missouri State might help uh, with the split pushing from uh, the Aurelia. Like Aurelia and Cassin, yeah. Let's well, it looks up. like the. the Catching Sivir out under Sivir, doing a dive. The disrespect from the Sivir walking into them. Lee Sin coming up from behind. They were pushed off the turret. Oh my gosh. Nearly overstaying and disrespecting. There's a lot of throwing going on around both for both teams. This is anyone's game. See let the items. Looks like Ezra's almost to his Triforce. When he gets that Triforce, he might bring some damage down. Be a factor. Hmm. Only Mazda are coming to stop the cast in top lane. Looks like Lee Sin's making his way Lee out. Lee Sin's on his way. Yeah. Looks like the Cassin is looking to make a play mid. Making a... But nothing's happening. No follow up from the pipe. Mm. No one, nothing contested. The game's going by pretty slow. Both teams playing it pretty carefully. Yeah, some plays seem to be careful, but some plays, both teams are just starting. <laughs> some of them are definitely overextending. Israel will clear the wave. Another Pike you in a miss, but looks like the Nars oh, oh a flash oh, engage. Man. Ooh. Oh a nice Ooh The kill from the Pike from the last hit on the turret. Another yeah, this is about to be a big play, Kassin coming in. But it looks like Mousehars. Yeah, Another pick. They still have Mauser Hulk, so it's really scary to dive. A pick. Some nice poke. But playing a little bit of A Ram. Yeah. So you can be able to get another poke out, uh, another pick, but uh, it looks like nothing's going down right now. I'm just getting some gold. Looks like everyone's giving oh, up. Oh, the pike coming up the from behind pie. alone to Clutching. pick off the Mazar. But is the pike gonna die for that one? Ooh, <laughs> one for one. Oh, it looks like the rally is. Are they about to turn this? You're really going in. Giving some shit then. Oh my gosh, the cats and picking up some big damage, looking to make a triple kill in the bot lane. Double kill! Triple kill from the Cassidin. Is he looking up to pick up a quadra kill? Looks like he's about to get nar. picked. Oh, is he about to turn this in? Nah, mm, no, oh no, that's the that's the Israel. Triple looking kill picked up by the mid lane from Missouri State. Big play. The Kassin is looking to become a problem if they don't end this game soon. He's 5-1. and one, Picked up a couple kills. He's going to have some gold to spend. I don't know if uh, UMKC can handle this Kassin display. Mid, uh, mid lane turret gone down. This is uh, 
<laughs> Looking like a turnaround for MSU. Definitely. Making some decent plays. Looks like the Ezra also picked up the Triforce. Looks like they're making a play on the Malzahar. Malzahar overextending a little bit too much. No escapes from that guy. So Don't want to push up too far with if, unless you have some dashes. The red lane oh. ping assist in the mid lane. Looks like they're Lost also trying to pick up the jungle. They'll get uh, picked off. Seeing the big nar pressure. Looks like uh, the one v one between the jungle and the ADC from UKC turns out in Missouri State's favor as Nidley picks up a kill. They're really going in mostly alone. Nar trying to one v five this game. It's last game, it looks like he's about to get some shutdown. Get kited out. He picks up one. Picks up the Kazdan. Looks like they're about to actually pick up the Braum too, overextending. One more Q will do it. As Pike picks up a double kill. Some spicy plays are going on. There, are Some pings oh, are going on ooh. the Baron, but it looks like they're just going to go they for the top end. pick up that name. Ooh. Looks like they're going to pick up this inhib with ease. Uh, they should probably reset at this moment. For sure. Missouri State has turned this game around as now they're up almost 10k as an 8k gold lead right now. This game has changed in the last two minutes. Two to five minutes, actually. Looks like Pike is looking for a pickup on the Malzahar again. Is he going to get the Q? Might be Israel. Leeson coming in from the side. Nar. Pike going a little too aggressive. But man, he it gets out easy. Easy. Just press that W button. You can't see him anymore. Yeah. He's gone. Man, now it's going to be really hard for UMKC to contest this drag as they have to handle top wave as supers are going to be pushing into their base. This game has turned out for the better for Missouri State, but as long as they play the game smoothly, it should be in their favor now. <laughs> the game was looking grim for Missouri State early, but games things turned around. Yep, they definitely uh, made some uh, good picks early in some nice team fights. Looks like the Lee Sin was a huge factor early, but it looks like he's not doing much now as he's 2 5 5. He's building damage, so, but I don't know if that damage is going to be what UMKC needs. He's definitely looking like a squishy member of the enemy team. Missouri State is clearing up some vision on the top side, making it dark for UMKC as they don't want to face chat. Like Three people. Oh. oh, no one wants to contest that casting. Yeah, no one wants to contest this casting. As no one is contesting there's a rally a, right now. Looks there's like a lot of fear going down. Looks like uh, rally is looking to split bot while they clear up some vision and contest Baron soon. Sending the Sivir against the Aurelia does not seem like a great idea, but let's see if it turns out. Aurelia does get pushed off the turret. The rally are making some plays, Ooh. but man. The mid lane really also. Starting and ending a dive. They Lee Sin a... going in for something, getting nothing. Yep, getting nothing. It's... Spike about to get the... another pick. Braum coming up with a fat ultimate, picking up Pike. Picking up the Pike. Cassid and just going bonkers. Cassid flashing in. Ooh. Cassid getting a double kill. This is going to be a, Ooh. oh, no triple for the Kassin, but Kassin's putting him some fat damage as... Mazenar. Rooting himself with his own ult. Man. Kassin going even in lane is becoming a huge factor for this game. Because, man, Kassin not falling Take behind. Take second in half. Yeah. Missouri State looks like they're going to win this game through this Kassin's gameplay as... 
Bot lane also went even this game too, so they are also being a factor, but the early game for Missouri State was not as clean as what was expected. Yeah. With two in hips down, man. UMKC is just backs against the wall. I don't know what they can do now. They have to get some uh, a lot of picks to uh, win this game. The red team picking the Baron, knowing that if it happened, contesting it would cost them a lot. Kassin picking up the Braum, it looks like. As Braum is not in the right place at the right time. Kassin still going in. But Ooh. it looks like Kassin. Looks like Kassin turning is in get out. still. Turn it down. Putting in the damage. With no Pickle fear. From behind. Pike picking up Ooh, the double the kill. Pike picking up the Q with the Q with the bro. It looks like. This game is looking pretty over. Yeah, this game is looking like Missouri State's picking up a 2 0 victory in week 5. But. Looks like Missouri State's about. Ooh. To win the second game of the Going series. For some kills and in the game. Missouri State looks to go even or Ooh. go undefeated. The with the disrespect. The disrespect. Missouri State goes still goes undefeated as they have one more game next week in the regular season. Stay tuned, guys. This will it'll be next Sunday at three o'clock. But thank you, Skyatic, for casting the matches with me. And yeah, everyone no have a everyone have a good evening.